Yo, Master Boards here with a new video. New video was good in the hood. Shaking nuggets with some hot sauce on the combos. Um, want to give y'all a little, little snort, short review of this past weekend. I went to Atlanta. I went to an FGC event called Final Round. Yes. Um, just to give you a quick rundown because I said everything in my vlogs. I need to check out my vlogs right now after this video. On my Master Boards UVG channel. Link in the description below. Because I already did like. Four different videos on me. Participating in this uh, event. So. Um, I'm not going to repeat what I said. On, on those videos. If y'all want to know what happened. Go to those vlogs. It's on my Master Boards UVG channel. But I would say. For, this, for the most part of this event. Because there's some things. I want to talk about after this. It's a great event. Okay, it's a great event. Shin Blanca did his thing, and shout outs to Big E, who's also on B E Gaming for always helping out. They are they the Harlem Heat of the FGC. You you can't stop that duo, bro. But yeah, um the event was smooth, you know, it was strong, you know what I'm saying? The only complaint I had I got from this event was they switched my bracket twice for Tekken 7. Even though I didn't complain about it when when it actually happened. You know what I'm saying? That, that's the only thing. But everything ran smoothly. Pools ran smoothly. Brackets ran smoothly. You know what I'm saying? Um, they was right on schedule. I think they ended earlier than expected um, the last day. Which, it was Sunday. So, I think they, they ended earlier than expected. And this is what I want to talk about because the owner of Final Round, Shane Blanca, recently posted on it. Well, not recently, it was a couple of days ago. Posted on Facebook that this will be his last Final Round. And I want to I want to explain why he said the way he said because he still hasn't recovered from the two Final Rounds ago. Of you know what happened because it was at the Hilton, you know, and I and this is the first time I took my best friend um, to this tournament, and I and I took him to la last year and this year, and he enjoyed himself, so that was good. Um, it was overcrowded, and it was a lot of mishaps, a lot of hiccups um, around that time. Um, you know, people were starting to uh, shit on it. You know what I'm saying? Yes, I curse. Um, it, it, it was a lot of bad moves. It was a lot of bad moves. But it, it just seems like, you know, especially with these black TOs, if you mess up one time, that's it. But you got some of these uh, uh, other TOs, you know what I'm saying, that be getting away with murder. You know what I'm saying? That do worse than that. I mean, mistakes is going to happen. You're going to have a bad run. You're going to have... Um, some hiccups here and there, and everything is not going to be perfect. But I, I, I just don't like the, uh, uh, the, 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 the disrespect that some other TOs did to his tournament, promoting their own tournament and not helping out. I always want to tell them and giving them destructive criticism, not constructive criticism, destructive criticism. Or how they tournament should be ran, you know what I'm saying? But I roll with Shim Blanca all the way, you know what I'm saying? I I I kind of recall that, you know, going to Atlanta a long, long, long time ago before it was even final round, you know that it is today. Gathering with people, beating people twice my age as a little kid in Street Fighter Two cabinets, um, around that time and, and going to his his gatherings as these events. The, the time I didn't know FGC was the FGC, you know. But, you know, it's good to have him around the FGC. He did a lot for the people he did. I mean, and I'm, and I'm glad he did the clear bags. Even though, you know, I uh, talked about it in my video for a little bit. Because, <clears throat> you know, you got people, stupid people, want to mess up the party for everybody, you know. Because the reason why he did that is because he, he wanted to keep people safe, you know. Especially after that uh, Twitch chat debacle where someone said they're going to shoot Evo. Um, 
which that's not cool, uh, and which that is stupid. And security is going to be tight this year if you plan on going to Evo this year. Um, but yeah, I, I don't want Shin Blanca to end it this way. You know what I'm saying? On a bad note. I just feel like I don't. I don't think he really mean that. I really think uh, he, I, he should take a break from it. But making it seem like you're retiring for final round for good, I, I I don't know. I don't think you should. You know, especially because these these airheads that are unappreciated what you do for these tournaments that you be holding on to, and you be running. They won't. They win. They won. You know what I'm saying? You can't let them win. You can't let them win. I mean, these are the same people that complain about every little thing. They want to be esports perfect. You know what I'm saying? The tournament was all right to me. I had no complaints about it, really. I don't. Ran smoothly. The venue was big. You know what I'm saying? He did all this for us. I mean, we even have Soul Calibur 6 demo. And that's another video. Um, The Soul Calibur 6 videos, that's going to be a live IRL hot sauce playthrough. I will be posting that tomorrow. Um, the Soul Calibur Six, and I'm gonna tell you my first impressions about it. Had a great time with that game, and I'm, I'm and like I said um, before on my other video, my vlog. I, I love it. But yeah, I digress. A lot of people are unappreciated, and then people want to like say something about some someone or something until it's gone. You know, um, want to want to miss it all of a sudden since it's gone, and I hate feeling that way, and I, I never felt that way in a while because some things just have to go away, some good things have to come to an end. It's just the way it is. That's just life. But in this case, a scenario, it, it should. Um, you, you're you're letting the negative people win by by them bringing your tournament down in your brand and that's one thing you don't do is bring in somebody's brand especially a brand that's trying to help you that's trying to give you exposure that's trying to like put uh put out an event where everybody can compete and also the first cpt uh capcom uh pro tour uh uh, uh qualifier this tournament here you 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 want to throw that away you know being the first and probably the first to ever do this tournament uh, uh, business. You know what I'm saying? The first tournament organizers. One of the first. So, you know, shouldn't block a take heed on what I'm saying. You know, you've been doing this final round stuff for 20 years now. And I hate to see you go like this. So, I, I wish you, you know, you all the best. But I understand your decision about, hey... You know, like you said before, it's a thankless job. And some things don't be appreciated until it's gone. Like I said before. Um, I, I I just wanted to like, I know I'm all over the place with this. But um, it, it, it's just a lot of things that's coming up to, in my head that it needs to be addressed. Um, black T.O.'s get a lot of flack than white T.O.'s. I'm just going to call it as it is. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to sugarcoat it. Period. I'm all about the real on this channel. If you didn't know, now you know. Um, just one thing that we do, it's a, it's a problem. It's kind of like me with YouTube. You know what I'm saying? If I don't do a, if I don't do a certain video, or if I don't do this certain thing in my videos, it's a problem. You know what I'm saying? And not really on this channel, but on my other channel. But um, I I think uh, final round should continue because this this is one of the main tournaments I go to first, beginning of the year because it, it it's held be in the beginning of the year, you know and, and I don't want I want I don't want this to go, and I'm pretty sure a lot of people don't want this to go either. So we need to hashtag say final round. But yeah, that's my take on it. You know what I'm saying? Um, if you want more information about this final round event, this FGC event, and want to know about the the spectrum that I'm in with these FG, FGC events, I can't even talk. Go to my vlog channel, my Masterboards UVGM channel, and watch 
the vlogs. I uploaded like four or five videos already. You need to watch it. And I also am going to upload some <laughs> tech and grudge matches I did with Shiji Kyle Flair on this channel. And also Soul Calibur uh, 6 uh, um, playthrough. Some footages I got for y'all um, tomorrow. So stay tuned for that. Without further ado, I'm your host, Master Boris. Yeah!